Hi, I'm Jay with Wilcox. Today we're going to talk about the Zero procedure for the Boss XE. The Boss XE is one of the most unique sights on the market today. It incorporates a red dot reflex sight as well as a laser optical bench. On the laser bench, we have our visible pointer, our IR pointer, our IR illuminator, and our IR room flood, which offers a low light infrared light that won't bloom out your night vision devices. It also features a customizable reticle and backup iron sights to serve as a point of reference. The integration of these systems into one unit translates into rail space savings, weight savings, increasing the operational efficiency of the end user. The Boss XE is a unique sighting system in that it features a dual position reticle. This reticle is going to allow the end user to either set two zeros for near and far, different weapons platforms, or even different types of ammunition as it was designed for. The dual position reticle is adjusted by two elevation adjusters and one windage adjuster. All your lasers are on a co-aligned optical bench. That means that once you've made these three adjustments, your lasers are all going to be aligned correctly according to your zero. When adjusting the elevation, we'll make sure that the trajectory switch is in the correct position. For the first elevation, we want to make sure that the trajectory switch is over in position one. And then for the second, we'll shift it over to position two. And then the windage adjustment is going to be on the side of the unit. We have to keep in mind that we're only going to use one windage adjustment for the entire process. In setting the mechanical zero, what we're going to do is crank the adjuster all the way up to one extreme or the other. So with elevation, we're going to take it all the way to the top, being careful not to over torque it because that'll damage the adjuster itself. And then we're going to count the number of clicks all the way to the bottom. Once we've gotten to the bottom, we'll take that number of clicks, cut it in half, and then count backwards. Once we're in the middle, that's our mechanical zero. After we've adjusted the first position, we'll move the trajectory switch to two, and then we'll adjust there. And we'll repeat the process for the windage. With the mechanical zero set, we're going to begin our live fire zero procedure. For this, we're going to be zeroing point of impact. After we've observed our initial shot group, we're going to make any adjustments that we need to. Once we've confirmed our zero, we're gonna flip the trajectory switch. While there are different applications for it, we're going to be using it to account for the bullet drop of subsonic ammunition. The Boss XE offers a lot in a compact integrated sighting system. With its dual position customizable reflex sight and co-aligned optical bench, it's going to allow us to put rounds on target based on our adjustments with speed and accuracy.